Hey guys, welcome back to Tabletop Assault. I'm Rich. I'm Will. And we've got a little kill team game for you today. Oh yeah. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. So we're playing Forward Push today. Um, what that essentially is, you get three objective markers across the battlefield. Across the battlefield? Across the battlefield. Um, each one is worth one victory point to whoever controls it at the end of the game. Usual caveats, you've got Slay the Leader. Um, force Break or Break Force? Break, Break, yeah, that one. Um, we've got Line Breaker and First Blood as well. So, what are you bringing today? I'm bringing my uh, Astro Militara. They are, I love them in kill teams. Lots of books on the ground. I know. So. And I don't like them so much that I've decided to bring my World Eaters against them. Yeah, not looking forward to that. First so, time I. Yes, yes. Yeah, first time I played against them. So, so uh, with that, guys, let's take a look at the forces. First up, we have the World Eaters kill team. Um, we'll start off with my leader there. He is an aspiring champion. Um, he's identified by marker number six, and the fact that it's an aspiring champion miniature. Um, he has got the gift of mutation, melter bombs. He is taking a power axe. He has a bolt gun. So no, he does not have a bolt gun. Sorry, he has a combi bolter, um, a combi melter. Um, with him today, my three specialists. Um, identified by marker number one is my combat specialist. He has killer instinct, so he's always wounding on a two. Um, uh, marker number two is identifying my dirty fighter specialist. He has poison weapons, so will always be wounding on a four up or re rolling in that failed wound uh, if the target's toughness is less than his strength, which is just going to happen because you're guard. Yeah. And finally, number three, this is my only proxy today, guys, and I am very sorry for it, my, is my eagle-eyed um, marine there. He has a plasma gun, not the heavy bolter. I was I quickly scrambling to get miniatures today, and that happened, sorry. And lastly, I've got three more marines there. As you see them, bolt gun, pistol, close combat weapons. And that is it for the world eaters. So with that, let's take a look at the guard. The guard. And here we have another one of my Astra Militarum kill teams. Again, lots of boots on the ground, lots to deal with. So I am rocking all veterans today. Um, no real upgrades, no, you know, camo gear, nothing like that. So it's gonna be uh, essentially three squads of um, veterans around today, so that's 30 models we're going to be looking at. Um, specialist number one, he's going to have Eagle Eye, which is going to increase the range of his grenade launcher. Um, specialist number two, we've got Feel No Pain, just try and keep him alive for a bit longer. I've decided to bring a Flamer this time, first time I've ever done that in a kill team. Um, that is specialist number three, I've given him stealth because he's going to have to try and get as close as possible. Uh, and then obviously my warlord or my war leader if you like on the end there. His warlord trait is going to be iron resolve. But um, that is it, just lots of las guns all over the place. Um, People do tend to, to get bogged down by these guys. It's a lot to shoot at in very few turns. So let's see how they um, let's see how they get on. This is our table setup for the kill team. Um, nice and tight. Lots of scatter. Lots of terrain. Um, obviously, three objectives for this mission. Number one is right here in the middle. Number two is right up on top of the shrine of the Aquila. And down here, you have objective marker three. So with that, we'll be right back after the deployment. So because of um, taking gift and mutation, my role in the Chaos Boon Table will be, the blues will be the tens and the white the units. 51, which will be, my champion is Adamantium Will. It's not gonna come into effect in this at all, but there we go, he doesn't like Zyphers. World Eater deployments, nice and simple. Big straight line. That's the specialist number two with the poison weapons. Kill instinct specialist. Up top here we have my eagle eyed plasma gun wielding specialist, which is beautiful. And right down in the building here, you can see my leader, the aspiring champion, and his personal bodyguard, I guess. 
Uh, so with that guys, let's go take a look and see what the guard are going to do. Here's the Astro Militarum counter deployment here, so let's see where all the veterans are. So I've got a little squadron of them here, um, just defending my objective in my deployment zone. I've got a few more in there just to lend support if um, Richard decides to come anywhere near them. Uh, got one of my specialists up there. Then my warlord is hiding right here behind the building. Typical just, guard. Yeah, got to save him. Um, then I have got this. Guard, 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 guard. Yeah, these guys are just aiming to just. I, I was not in the room. I was not in the room when that was set up, and I came back and the hilarity. Yeah, <laughs> they're just gonna run straight forward and just camp out on that thing. Yeah, and then uh, just over to the side here, just a wee flanking squad, uh, five guys as well, and that is it for the Astra Militarum kill team deployment. May as well roll for night fighting while we're at this. Absolutely, let's do this. So, night fighting is on. I need that. You need that. Um, and I need to seize the initiative on six. Oh, very close. close. So, let's crack on with the uh, Chaos Turn 1. World Eaters Turn 1. World Eaters Turn 1. World Eater deployment was incredibly simple. Mm -hmm. The line just moved up. Hopefully, well, I won't get a repeat of what happened to my space. It was the last time I faced the guard. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot of last gunfire. It's a lot of last gunfire. Anyway, they just moved on up. Uh, let's get straight into the shooting phase. So my plasma equipped eagle eye specialist is going to shoot at your eagle eye specialist in the building there yeah. because I'm a bit afraid of him. So it'll be three to hit. Yes, and it will be a three to win. He wins, definitely wins. Oh, it's a two to win there, actually. Oh, what's two to win? Yeah. Four to so I've got uh, five up there and plus one for night fighting, so it's a four up I need. Will he survive? No. No, so that is, that is first blood. First blood. First blood. So the normal space marine here, case mm -hmm. space marine, is going to fire at uh, the unit over by the, um, the objective. objective. Yeah. Needing a three to hit, he fails miserably. My aspiring champion is mm -hmm. going to fire his bolter. Yeah, same, same, same guys. Same guys. He hits, and then a three, and it's a wind. So again, four up. No, oh, that's he another does. guy died. Lovely. Ah. Specialist number one is going to fire his bolt, his, his bolt gun right through the door into the guard over there. Mm -hmm. Looking for a three. Yes, and looking for a three. And he wins. Would you like to make a save? Yep, so I am just going to take the night fighting safe because I believe it's clear shot, isn't it? Yep, yep, right through the door. Yep, so I need six. <laughs> no, couldn't be further from it. So that's another guy dead. Uh, this guy here, this mm -hmm. is the chaos me here, is going to shoot right the way through there and go try and get this body center mass. You're going to get a bit of a better cover save there. There's a few things in the way. You can still see. In the three, in the three. No, oh, doesn't no, matter. Doesn't matter. This, this special here is actually going to shoot over at this little cut of um, guard mm -hmm. behind the crate. It's a six, it's a hit, three to wind, and he also fails to wind. And my last Chaos Marine is going to fire back into the big bob of guard, 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 guard. Three, yes, and three. And he fails to wind. So, not a spectacular turn of shooting there, but that draws a close to the um, uh, World Eaters turn, first turn one, goes up. Alrighty, so in Astra Militarum, turn one, I'm gonna move these guys forward. Big blob of guard are gonna move forward as well. These guys are going to hold my objective, and I might move these guys forward. I'm not sure just yet. I might keep them where they are. But that's it. Just let's get on with movement, guys, and let's get to some shoot. Okay, so let's start the shooting. So I've got this squad of guys here. 
And if she's not squads, they're individual units, but they effectively work as squads because there's so many models in this yeah. game. For, for me, I don't roll individual guys. Whenever I play Astro Militarum, I bundle them into squads. They're not squads in the game, I realise this, but um, I like to roll lots of dice. So, five guys into your specialist there. Specialist there, yeah. Specialist number two. Okay, so I am going to need threes due to them being veterans. Wow. Nice. Actually, even if you were normal guard. Yeah, that would have done well. And then I need fives here. That's caught. There you go. So one three up safe. And he's fine. Fine. Okay, next up, we've got five guys here. They're gonna shoot the, the marine taking cover there. So I'm gonna need uh, threes again. Not bad. Not bad, at all, man. Not bad at all. Five and sixes to do something. That's two. And uh, yep. Oh, wow. Doubly dead. <laughs> Doubly dead. That's a big loss. Okay, I've got two guys here. Unfortunately, these last pistols are actually just out of range. So I've got a last gun here and a grenade launcher, which will fire a crack grenade. So we'll do the crack grenade first. Are you firing at the guy with the plume? Yeah, just him there. So I'm going to need three to hit. Yep, two's to wound. Done it. And you'll need a three up save. Three up save. And he makes it. I do have that last gun as well, which will take a wee pot shot out. So I'm going to need threes to hit. Yep. Five sixes to wound. Nope. Nothing. Saved. Next up, we've got these five guys here. They're going to shoot through the door at the world eater there. So I'm going to need uh, threes again. Whoa, what's it with you and sixes in this uh, game so far? That never usually happens to me. Uh, Even and again though. Fives or sixes. So one save there. And a uh, few. No, oh, no, that's, that's another, terrible. Another marine this, down. This is going to be another two turn kill team for me. I feel <laughs> like. And then last but not least, nice and quick, I've got six guard in here shooting through windows and they're going to aim for your warlord man. Let's see what they can do. So I'm going to need threes here. Oh, okay. And then I'm going to need fives and sixes here as well. Oh! Whoa. Three threes! He's oh, dead. Oh, and that is Slay the Leader. That's, this is terrible. This is this is the last time I bring an elite group against your Astro Tower. <laughs> yeah, it's boots on the ground, man. That's how you win. Kill teams. But yeah, that is, that's it. That's it for Astro Militarum. Uh, let's just move on to uh, World Eater's counterattack. At this stage, it's trying to set up some kill zones and trying to keep my guys safe from as much of your shooting as possible. Yeah. So um, let's come back once I've finished the uh, movement phase. So two of my marines there are now hunkering down behind this wrecked tank, hoping for the best. My last basic guy is hiding in here to try and get some cover. And my plasma gun is still up the top there, ready to wreak some, wreak some havoc. So with that, let's move into the shooting phase. Starting with the specials here, he's going to rapid fire his bowgun into this guy through here in the door, needing threes. Needing threes. This guy's going to do exactly the same. Needing threes. Needing threes. One save to make there, sir. No, actually, no save at all, he's just dead. No save, it's just exactly. there, And the marine down here will now fire through his window into here to try and kill another one. Threes. Threes. And that's another and one. That's dead. dead. Finally, we'll just move on. We'll lastly, we'll use the plasma gun up here. You'll get one shot. And he misses. Ah, oh, nightmare. But that's it for the World Eaters uh, turn two. Let's go and see how the um, mob of guard are just going to completely swamp me. Guard, <laughs> guard, 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 guard. Alrighty, so that's the, um, the Astro Militarum have moved over. They're linking arms and they're charging. 
Um, terrifying. Yeah. They're moving forward. They're not going to charge. I'm going to shoot. Um, moving forward. Yeah, I know. Moving the other veterans just across there as well, just to hunker down over that objective. And I've not even moved my, um, my other guys, really. Just kept them where they are, hunkered down there. Yeah, that's it. Let's just get on with Astra Militarum shooting. Alrighty, so I'm going to start with my heavy flavor. Right there, so I've got the two of them. Uh, heavy flamer will need to catch you on threes. And it's only one. It's a good start. Yeah, so it's a two and a three, so you might as well roll your armor save. I made it. <laughs> he, he loved it. He did. So I'm fairly confident with the, uh, the number of boots I've got on the ground that I'm gonna get this all secured. However, just for the, just for the, the lols, shall we say, I'm gonna fire a uh, frag grenade there. <laughs> I kinda want this to backfire and come flying back at me. I think that would be pretty funny. But I'm gonna pop it over his head there. We'll get both of them. So, do 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 do. Direct hit, however. Oh, no. Pow. So frag grenade will get you on fives. So we'll get you both on fives. Oh, what? oh my word. What? Am I gonna get this frag grenade for the you win? Just, you deserve it. For that. Oh, no, you don't. Oh, man. You don't. But you deserve that. that. And yeah. honestly, you deserve killing them. That would, that would have been good. But no, that, that's that's those specialists out of the way. And then um, let's see. We've got these guys here. So that's going to be six rapid fire shots, seven, eight all told from the, uh, the last pistols as well. I might as well fire them four at a time. First one and second one? Yeah, I first think. one's going to get four shots at them. Stop wow. rolling so many fires and sixes. Uh, no, I, I never rolled it. Why can't I bring this to our bat reps? I know, right? You know, Because kill teams don't care. I know. Here we go. So, let's see how many fives and sixes again. But I don't get them that time. Okay. Okay. Next guy. Okay. William. Where are these coming from? I need this the second time round, guys. Here we go. Uh, give me more fives and sixes, please. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, what's going on? Chaos gods are laughing in my face right now. Uh, I will be back in a second once I figure out what I'm going to do next. Alrighty. <laughs> this is proven to be um, a bit fickle shooting face for myself. So we've got these four guys here are the only ones that can actually see the, uh, the marine there in the building through the window. There he goes. So it's going to be four shots into them. Or into him, should I say. Going to need threes. Okay. That's a done. Fives and sixes. Oh, come on, William. Only one. Yep. Oh, yeah. Wow, yeah. not a single thing killed this turn. I'm actually... I wonder. Do you know what? Just for the fun of it, let's do some guard charges. Let's do it. Who can charge? Las pistols. Oh, oh bold. Okay. Let's do it. Okay. Charge! <laughs> Alrighty, and with their brass balls of steel, these two guys are gonna charge the Chaos Marine or the World Eater if you like. I am going to overwatch the first one. Yep. And nothing, do nothing. nothing. So I need three inches here. So, first one, mid. Second one, mid. Okay. Get him! Get him! Ah! I don't know what's going on. <laughs> what's your initiative? Oh, you get to hit me first. Cool, man. right. So. <laughs> I'm a world leader, because of all the special rules, I have to take as part of the rules. Um, and Mark of Corn and everything, blah blah blah. I'm attacking them with three. I'm going to put two on one guy and one on the other. Fair I'll be hitting you on um, threes, I assume. Yep. Yeah, two hits. And the wound, killing, wounding you on not that. <laughs> and the other one three. hit, wounding. He is wounded, so, so the second one is wounded. So I will get a five up. Uh, save on that. Yeah. Ah! <laughs> wow. Here we go, boys. Let's get him. How many attacks are you attacking with now? Um, do you know what? Um, I need to gather some dice and then we'll get back to that. I believe I'm going to have three attacks apiece here. <laughs> okay, to my utter surprise, Fair and Sergeants have two attack base, extra attack for close combat weapon and pistol, and a charge. These guys are getting four attacks apiece. Yeah! 
<laughs> so let's do this. So it's going to be eight attacks on this guy. So I'm going to need fours to hit, then fives and six to win. So fours. Boom. Easy. Sorry. There we go. So I've got three there. Not as many as I'd want. And then fives or sixes. Get him. One. That's all I need. Yeah. Feel it. He's ah! fine. He's fine. He doesn't care. He doesn't care. He's like, what? <laughs> Damn. I was really ha hoping that would pay off, but ah uh, well, no, that is it for my charges. Just gonna do some run moves now. He's running the shooting phase. Swam. So, yep. Yeah, I'll negate those. Never mind. <laughs> uh, we'll be right back with the World Eaters turn uh, three. I have one move to make. And he's now ideally like the whole awning thing. That's that that that's it. We're going to move into the um <laughs> we'll move into the uh, shooting phase. The plasma gun is gonna shoot into your flamer special actually. Okay. Um looking for uh three hit. Okay, he has actually good give me two seconds. I'm going to check something here. He is in rapid fire range because yeah. of Eagle Eye, so Let's two hits. Hit. And then two is to win. Wow, he's dead. Yeah, very dead. And finally, I've got my rapid firing bolter from my marine down here. Mm -hmm. He's going to shoot into this guardsman right there, looking for uh, threes, which both hit, and then threes, which both wound, and he's and another, another dead guy. Yeah. With that, guys, we're going to go into the assault phase. My marine here is now going to charge into your guardsman. Would you care to overwatch? I sure will. So, rapid fire. One, one. hit. One hit. Need five or six. No. Lord. I need a four to charge. <laughs> yeah, it's totally I'm just going to gather some dice and then we'll get this sorted. I don't stop making a mess of this. So, I'll be attacking, I'll be hitting you on threes. Mm -hmm. Oh, bar one, and I will be wounding you on like yeah, threes. Oh, corn does not smile on you today. Well, after that disappointment, um, one attack on each of the veteran sergeants. Yeah, let's do it. So hitting on threes. Oh, oh my God! What? What? Yes, I threw that dice in the floor in rage. <laughs> What? <laughs> Can't believe this. Tight combat. Uh, we'll be back with um, guard turn uh, turn three. Okay, so I've moved three of the veterans up, the other three back onto the objective there just to hold it. Then. This. The massive charge, here we go, they're all funneling in here just now. Uh, I am going to be declaring more charges in a minute. Um, yeah. I'm just, I'm just, this is literally what you're seeing. You're witnessing chaos being drowned in boots at the moment. But, um, we're going. We <laughs> <do it. laughs> the guard, this is how we do it. So, um, yeah, let's just crack on with a bit of shooting and then would you imagine it? I'm actually focusing more on the assault phase and I'm guard. Who would have thought? Who would have thought? <laughs> but yeah, let's crack on. Okay, so for after military shooting, we've got these three guys here, plus <laughs> these five guys here, and for good measure, the crack grenade. Uh -huh. All firing up at this guy here. Woo! Let's get him! So uh, it's going to be eight shots from the last guns. So let's do this. I'm going to need three. You roll the play. Your first bad roll of the day. That was it. Oh, it's 50-50. There we go. So five and six. Oh, God. Five and sixes. Oh, only two. There you go. Don't die. Ah, got him. I got him. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yeah. <laughs> As one dead world you. I enjoy that a bit too much. <laughs> well, seeing as he um, never got that far, the crack grenade, instead of lending his fire to that fight, I guess he's going to have to shoot the guy through the window there. No. So let's roll for that now. So, yes, threes to hit. 
And deuce. There you go, my friend. Three of six. Ah! He's just lobbed a crack in through that window. <laughs> yeah, this is turning into a bloodbath. So this and is a bloodbath. That is it for all my shooting. We've got two locked combats here, and I am going to drown them in guard bayonets. Let's do it. Charge! Okay, so Astra Militarum charging. Now, these guys were only an inch away, so didn't bother to roll for that because, let's face it, they're not going to fail. However, this guy is going to try and charge in here. Now, he will need three inches. Three inches to get him to add his weight to the fight. Oh, massively in. So, that's him in as well. And then this guy, mm -hmm. I would imagine, just get around there. We'll call it two inches. Yeah, get him. There, yeah. Oh, yeah. There you go. Right. Oh, Might need to um, gather some dice and do some rolling. Let's do this. And there we go. Let's do this. So with those guys on the charge, I have got 11 attacks here to make. 11. Have you ever seen a wolf hunting a bear? This is yeah. kind of what it's like. Exactly. So it's going to be, let's see, fours to hit, fives mm. to wound. So let's do this. Oh, very good roll. Well, actually, it's like half of it missed there. Fives here. Ah, no one! <laughs> no one! <laughs> I get to attack back. I've got like two attacks. Threes. <laughs> the excitement that washed off your face there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna kill you in real life. I know, I know. Sorry. <laughs> so after have, that, we do have on. one more combat to go. Might as well get some dice for it and pow! Let's do this. I actually have the initiative here, so it didn't really matter in that last combat because you rolled two twos. <laughs> I will end you. But let's do this one. Let's do this one. You get um, first. Threes. Oh. Ah! Oh, it's, it's not the dice, it's just you. <laughs> just you, my friend. <laughs> that bounced off his head. <laughs> yes, it did. Okay, so. Oh, I, I should have taken a break test. Oh, no, it's not my turn. Let's start your turn, yeah, which you will have to take in a minute. So I've got eight attacks coming back. Gonna need fours here. Only two got through. <laughs> Can't believe we're gonna get locked in combat again here. So I'm gonna need fives and sixes. Oh, one. Failed. Not a two. Ah. Yay! Car, car, car. <laughs> he says very deflated. There we go. Well, that that is it for the uh, for the guard. Um, what are you gonna do, Rich? Weep. Yeah. Well, you're gonna have to take some break tests. So let's uh, let's come back to uh, corn. Is it turn four? Yeah. 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 yeah it's turn four. Turn four. So I just walked around the table to prep for the shot for me looking all white. And I just realised the leader is still back here, not even in the game. Yeah! I, mean, I'm I do it every kill team, man. I hide my leaders. You like Ross? <laughs> yep. Anyway, I've got two break tests to take because I can't move, so we skip straight to my movement phase. Um, this is where I'll roll. If, if I roll a nine or more, someone's running. So for the guy by the tank, He's staying! And for the guy by the objective. He's dead! <laughs> <laughs> well, you have one guy, one desperado, one lone wolf. <laughs> Who attacks first? Well, you got one attack. And. and no wound. No, no, that's, that's not. That's not. Well, let's let's go into this definitive 
Astra Militarum <laughs> turn four. Is your attack back in turn whatever? Oh yeah, yeah. You've got how many? Oh. Two, four, you've got like eight, 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 eight attacks. Yeah, I'll gather some dice actually. This could be it, this, this could this, be it. This could legitimately do it. Two for the bets. One take turn. Yes, yeah, six. six. There you go, okay. Da, da, da. No, it's just six. Six? Eight. Yeah, two for the vets. Okay. Two for the vets each, and then one for each guard. Let's get him. We can do this. Yeah. Oh, wow. Just stop rolling five and six. <laughs> <laughs> I've never rolled this well. What's going on? These dice must be loaded. Right. And then I'm going to need fives or sixes. Oh, wow. There we go. <laughs> So one fail, there we go, and this could be it. And that's it! White. Astro Militarum win White. by charging marines. White. <laughs> Corn loves the guard. Corn does did love good, the guard. Did a good job, Karn can't be. Corn can't be happy, unhappy because <laughs> blood has been spilled and blood was spilled kind of gloriously. Let's come back another quick chat. I don't know what to say about that one, guys. That was an incredibly strange game. I've never seen you roll so many numbers above one in my entire life. Yeah, <laughs> usually it's the other way around. I always roll really bad. I, the dice gods usually hate me. They have really, really been on my side today. I don't know what happened here. I, ne I never charge with um, Astro Militarum. This is the first time I've ever charged with them, and who thought it would go that well against World Eaters? David and Ross are not going to let me let this down. No, no, they definitely won't. But I um, think it's proof of the pudding that kill teams are at the stage where if you've got the dice, you've got the game. Yeah, that, that's why I always say quality in numbers. So you have to take this 30 guard spam against um, the speeder. Yeah, yeah, I think I'll think. I don't know what, what you think, guys. David's screamer list against my uh, my Astro Militarum. They're fast and they're tough, but if you roll like that, yeah, could be one, could be one to showcase. But yeah, anyway, that is it. A resounding Astro Militarum victory. Corn is happy. Corn doesn't mind. Blood was gloriously spilled by the wrong people. But yeah. <laughs> um, thanks for watching. <laughs> I did enjoy playing. <laughs> <laughs> But anyway guys, uh, drop us a few comments below, let us know what you think. Um, again, you want to see the Screamer list versus my guard? Let us know. Okay, okay. Um, hit subscribe if you like, drop us a wee like if you liked, and then um, hopefully we'll see you next time on Tabletop Assault.